I talked about how easy Dometic toilets are to install and now I want to demonstrate it. Come on. Today we're going to upgrade the toilet in my vintage travel trailer restoration project. The first step is to turn off the water supply going to the toilet. Next we'll remove and drain the water supply line. Now you can remove the toilet hold down bolts and remove the toilet from the floor. Whenever you remove or replace an RV toilet, you should discard the old floor flange seal and replace it with the new one. We want to verify the center of the floor flange is at least 10 inches from the back of the wall for the Dometic toilet we're installing. Make sure the top surface of the floor flange is clean and free of any debris or sealant. Insert the two supplied T-bolts into slots in the floor flange. Verify that the floor flange seal is installed on the base of the toilet and carefully set the toilet over the floor flange aligning the holes in the toilet base with the T-bolts as the toilet is lowered onto the floor flange. The toilet base does not rest completely on the floor yet. The floor seal must be compressed using the following steps. Install the floor mounting nuts and washers onto the T-bolts and carefully tighten. Do not over tighten. Alternate between sides when tightening to prevent distortion of the toilet base. When tight, the base should be securely attached and flat against the floor. Attach the bolt covers onto the nuts. Connect the water supply line and turn the water on. Flush the toilet several times and check for any leaks. Well that about does it. Regardless of what type RV you have, Dometic has an RV toilet and consumable products designed specifically for you. To learn more about RV toilets and holding tank treatments, take a minute to visit www.dometic.com. Happy camping!